All the many Kung Fu styles that have been developed in various parts of China, the one recognized as being the most difficult and the most deadly is the Tai Chi technique. Anyone who wishes to learn it must devote his life to it and must start as a child, preferably at the age of three. He must bathe in the secret lotions, take the special pills and hold to a rigorous diet for 30 years. The Earth's fundamental forces are tapped via the eight octograms. The whole body is in balance. A change in emphasis in one part of the body will affect a countering change in another part. The routines are incredibly difficult to learn, and few either qualify or have the strength to learn Tai Chi Kung Fu. The first steps are to concentrate all energy in the head, to lighten the body. After that, more weight is concentrated in the feet, to promote stability. Finally, all parts of the body are coordinated and fused so that it acts like a single but complex muscle. The result is fantastic strength and control. Every ounce of the body's strength can be transformed instantaneously to one single part. Of the very few who achieve it, their fingers become like steel, their feet steady as rock. Their kicks are like thunderbolts, the fists can break stones. When Tai Chi is mastered, the body changes too. The yeah. voice becomes high in pitch and strange to the ear. The hair loses color and becomes like snow. The character becomes volatile to match the body's speed. And the body, while retaining its suppleness, becomes impenetrable and impervious to weapons. And yet, the Tai Chi expert is not completely invulnerable. There is always one weak point, both in the learner and in the master. With the body's 108 strategic points, the vulnerable point can be moved at will. Sometimes the soles of the feet, sometimes the throat or armpit. Yet, out of reflexive habit, the Tai Chi expert will usually tend to use the same place in moments of stress to place the weak point, a habit which can be fatal. Please, I beg you, won't you please let us both go? I swear, I'll repay the favor. We've our orders, and they're quite clear. Take you back to Chinsan. No, I won't go there simply to die. Your chiefs are much too cruel. Well, you are going there. Master Chin is waiting. 
Brother, look. Let's stop them. Forget it. Brother, we've got to do something. Master has said not to get into fights. And he also said help the weak. Well, didn't he? Senior will decide. But look. Those cruel bastards. Get up. Take the sword. Because we don't like fighting an unarmed man. No. Because 20 years ago I swore a great oath. I would rather die. Take up my sword again. Garbage, pick it up! I won't! Damn you! Come on, fight! Hey! Yeah. Hey, brother! Hey, you! Wanna die? You must stop this! Listen, you keep out of this. You'll only get hurt. And that's very good advice. But still, it comes a bit too late. Ha! Some of the men are fighting with the two Haytai killers. It's awful. Oh? Well, let's go. Right. Two men want to bully these two people. Do you think that's a fair thing to do? We're from Chen Yin San, where fairness doesn't count for much. I've heard much about you. They say you're tough. So I think I'll find out just how tough you are. Well, I'll tell you this. You'll regret it, because it's the last thing you'll do. We'll see. What? <laughs> Hot! 
admit you're better than us. We hate pie killers, admit defeat. <laughs> but you're gonna die, that I promise you. Right. Why did this happen? Why didn't you stop your brothers? I have told you so many times. All that you're taught here. Skill. Strength. It's just for one end. Self-defense. <sighs> Mingtu. Sao Chun. Lu Chin. How can you so easily forget the rules I've taught you? Sorry, Sorry sir. Sorry? I treat you well. Regard you as my own children. I'm responsible for you. Teach you martial arts. And now, Cheng Wu has been killed. Ming Tu, do you have any idea what I'm feeling? And what I will say to his parents? Master, it was all my fault. And not the others. Therefore, I accept the responsibility. No. Master, I started it. So I'm the one to be punished. And all the others simply followed me. Master, don't punish senior brother. Master, just punish me. Master, this whole thing was due to me. I ask you, please do not punish these young men. I mean, it's really my fault. Well, I'm sorry, sir. But these pupils have done wrong. They've broken the rules so they must be punished. No, Master. Helping the weak is surely no crime. When they saw me, they felt pity. And compassion is never bad. So I beg you, please pardon them. You should rest. You've been injured. Ying Ying, help Mr. Lu to his room. Yes. Now I'll listen. The senior pupil, Ming Tu, will receive one month in penitence. Sa Chun, because he was not in charge there, will receive two weeks. Lu Chen must also pay for his imprudence. For the next three years, he will not receive lessons. Thank you, Thank you Mr. Mr. That is me. Oh? Do you recognize us then? You're the Chin Yin chiefs, I imagine. I have heard of you. <laughs> That's us. Well, all right. Can I help you? I hear Lu Chin and his girl are hiding in this school. And we have come here to get them. Huh? Lu Chin is my enemy, and we have an old score to settle. Your school is not involved. And providing I get Lou, I will forget what has happened. One pupil died protecting this couple. They are here now in my keeping, and they'll stay. They think I want them. Liu Chen is injured. He needs treatment. He cannot move yet. I would suggest you give him time. All right, I shall give him time. He can have two hours. Two hours? Well, I know. Those men are superb fighters. Master, in my view, we can't beat them. If we fight them, I think they'll kill us all. Don't agree. Master. Listen to me. Well, go on. If we have to fight, let me go first. That will give you some time 
to make your plans. That way, you'll have your two hours and a bit more. No, I won't permit that. What do you suggest? Since I am the cause of all this, then it's fitting that I should go out there and settle this myself. Dad, you can't do that. Dad, you go out there and they'll kill you. <laughs> Sophie, I must go out. I've no other choice. I mean, otherwise they'll destroy this school. Dad! Tell me, what did you do to the Chin Ying? that they want you. Twenty years ago, the Chin Ying chiefs were in Huapei, and they committed many crimes there, and they killed a great many people. At the time I was traveling through, saw what they'd done. From what you say, you must be a great fighter. So why don't you fight them? No. I've taken an oath before Buddha to kill no more. And so, no matter what happens, I swear I will not lift a sword again. Leiping! The time is up! Right. Well, all right. Come on out then. No point in putting this off. Dad! You can't go out there. I beg you, please don't do it. She's right. You can't go, but I can, and I will too. I already owe you too much. So then, I'll not see this school destroyed for my sake. My friend, I've already lived my life, and I'm ready to die. But one thing, my daughter here. Master, look after her. Dad! Dad! Now listen. The Leaping School is an honorable place. While I'm here, no one harms you. Brother, let me go first. After all, I'm the senior, so it's right I should. Anyway, those men, they need to see that we're not scared of them. Maybe when they see we're not afraid, they may even back off. My swords! For them. Well, maybe not, but I'll try. You two are evil men. Must be stopped. So then, today I shall try to do that. I shall take it. Hey, right. give him a quick trip to heaven. Master, let us go with you. 
Him. No! Me too. Sir. Today the Lee Ping School here is fighting a battle to preserve its name. And if I should die out there, you will take over the school. Listen. And listen well. Without my permission, nobody is to go out there. All right? And don't you forget that, huh? Sir. Master. Oh. You be real careful. Hmm. All right. Now close the gate. Sir. Get back inside! Dad! Jun Ti Wu Jen <laughs> Duku Ten. Well, all right. I'm ready now. Listen, this one I think should be mine. Well, watch him. This one won't be quite so easy. You're so right. Come on. I would never use my sword again. What has happened here has changed all that. Today, because of me, two honorable men have been killed. And I can't bear that! One of you fights first. One will be enough. Ah! 
me! Teacher. Dad, you'll be all right. Ming Jo. Master. Hang the sign again with honor. Yes, Master. Uh, teacher. Teacher. Oh, Now listen, for honor's sake, our master and uncle laid down their lives. And their killers, those two men, are not just our foes, but all societies. So then, as from today on, we must practice with all of our strength, with one purpose in mind, one reason, that's to kill the Chinyin chiefs. And if I should die, Brother Er here will take over. And his orders are, same as mine, kill the Chinyin chiefs. No matter what the cost, they must be destroyed. Now then, we must hang the school sign high again, or else we'll lose honor and shame Master's name. Now tomorrow, my penitence begins. Sao Chun also, for two weeks, Lu Chen stops his lessons. Those were Master's orders. Before he died, we will obey them. Sir! said you should stop it's been two weeks it's enough if you carry on you may get sick no master said to do this for one month and i'll obey his order master don't worry i'll follow your instructions
Brother? The master said no practice. Not for three years. Forgive me, I hear. Uh, Brother? Teacher. Listen. If you do this again, you will be expelled. Yes. I'm going to fight a duel. Maybe I shall not come back. And in that case, Brother Err will take charge. You must obey him. The school's honor must be upheld. And you may not rest until the chiefs are killed and the master's tablets inscribed. <laughs> well, now, I must give you this. You must have guts to come and face me. Jinpa. I'm gonna make you suffer. You stupid fool. You'll die here. <laughs> hey, you. What's this trick? simply no use. I let the master down. I knew I was no match for Chin Pa. I had to use a trick, or else I'd be dead. Brother, now don't blame yourself. You can try again. Just wait a while. Right. Me too. Don't worry. We know you did your best. 
No one blames you. I shall go to Chun Tien. Master, I must leave. Today, I'm going up to Chun Tien. And there, I'll practice hard. Until I'm quite ready. Maybe for 10 years. Till I'm ready to avenge you. All right, get ready. You must go now. Right. Now listen. As from today, you'll all obey Brother Er. All right? Yes, yes sir. sir. I'm going. Brother, you take care. Hey, Pai Killers. Well, Ming Tu, you can die here today, or you can come with us and beg the Chinyan chiefs for mercy. Maybe you'll be lucky, and they'll spare your life. You let me go. In one year, I shall fight you all. We can't wait. You either come with us or die. You go to hell. He's staying here. Brother, you forget. You can't fight. Now look, leave me alone. Are you coming out of there? Seems I've no choice. Brother, let them in. We'll handle them. You can't fight. Now wait. Hey, do you really want to fight? Right, and I promise you, you'll be the first to die. Those Lei Ping students? All of them! Listen, when those Chin chiefs hear the news, they'll be here. So you better leave this place quickly. Brother Er will take you all up to Chi Sing Mountain. And I will go to Pei Long San. And don't forget, we have to kill those chiefs, no matter what. Let's split up. You go to Chi Sing Mountains. I'll head for Pei Long San. It'll take me two days. Right. We'll see you then. Now you look after them. I'm depending on you. I will. I'm off. Right. Let's go. Come on. Koshi Cave. 
Right. Brothers, for our master's sake, we have to live here for now. Those who feel they can't, they can leave. I'll stay till those chiefs are dead, even if it takes all my life. And you? Right! right. Awu. Sir. Take him inside and let him rest. Sir. Gone. Sir. Right. Come on. <laughs> He's already gone back, back to the school. Yeah, I have to kill those chiefs, then raise the master's tablets. But they both fight so well, particularly Chief Tier. I know, Tai Chi Kung Fu is one of the best. Unfortunately, to learn it well, one has to start early, as a child. Tai Chi is nearly invulnerable, and that's the problem. There must be, there must be a way. lots of oil, which will make it impossible to get a grip on the blade. That could get me that split-second advantage, if I'm fast enough. And I'll have to be. I'll get just one chance, and no more. Well now, Chin Pa, so we meet again. <laughs> you again? You made any progress? Well, you'll soon find out. But if you beat me, you can live.
I've just been killed by Yu Ming too. Hmm. All right, Yu Ming too. I promise. I'm soon going to kill you. Are you the teacher of the Lei Ping School? Yes, I am. My name is Yu Ming too. Chief Jin Pa, did you kill him? Hmm. Yes, I killed him in a fair fight. Damn you! You're going to pay for that with your life. Well, maybe. But perhaps with some luck, I can locate your weak spot. Right. Try it. Watch out. I'm not going 
Brothers, come here. Sir. Sir. Brother, what is it? Today is Master's third anniversary. Master, this day, once again, we all swear our loyalty to the school. Master, rest in peace. Well, get up. Now let's practice. today? Third anniversary of Master's death. You know that? In that case, why are you sleeping here? Get going! Yes. Sing, you owe me. And today, I'm going to try to collect. Oh, <laughs> 
<laughs> Damn you! I'll teach you to fight with me! here later, then he'd have died. Doctor, he... In time, he'll recover all right. But still, no more martial arts for him. Oh, but why? It's his heart muscles. They have been permanently damaged. So no exertion? <laughs> Listen. Brother Ur has been defeated by Tyr. If it hadn't been for Nan, he wouldn't be with us today. Tyr would certainly have killed him. And now, Brother Ur can't fight, certainly not for a long time yet. Therefore, I must take up the responsibility. And I swear, we shall avenge the Master and put up his tablets. Or stay in this cave for the rest of our lives and live like a pack of rats. body has 108 pressure points. Main ones, 36. Minor, 72. The most vulnerable, eye, mouth, nose, throat, ear, and groin. Persons who are expert at Tai Chi Kung Fu have only one, and that one can be moved and be varied at will. So if you ever intend to fight such a man, you have to try and find out his weak spot first. And even so, you'll have to fight very well and need lots of luck, too. In fact, your chances of winning are quite slim. Most likely, you will be killed. My master and my brothers have died at your hands. But one day, I'll kill you! Huh. That's not likely! Huh. Don't be too sure. I'll get you. Even if it kills me! That's all? Well, why not try now? Be careful. Brothers, better back off. 
Let's go. God damn you. Well, what now? Now you die here. Right. Well, we'll see who's gonna die here. schools seem to have a great number of cowards. Since it is you who asks, I'll let her go. Curb your killing, or you'll die too. Mercy, mercy. Hey, brother, I have an idea. I don't like it, but it might work. Hey, what is it? I'll challenge him. Kao Yong, Chung Sung. Sir. Cao Ming. Sir. Cheng Zhao. Yes. yes. 
When I'm fighting him, you pour oil over him. Then you wait to let him signal. Then when I'm clear, you light the oil. <sighs> we can't do that. Not the leaping school. We won't pull any tricks like that. Now look, we've no choice. Somehow we've got to get him, haven't we? <sighs> you go rest. But listen! Stop bothering me! We must rest. Sir. 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 Brother! Oh, how is he? He just took the medicine. That may help him. wanted to thank her. We were real worried. Oh, listen. The nun told me something. She said that we can find Tia's weak point only when he's not being himself. Only when he's not being himself? What does that mean? He's such a vicious and evil man. He very rarely laughs. Oh? <laughs> well, you see, when he laughs, he's not being himself. <laughs> his throat. Hmm, right. His weak point. His throat. Right. That makes sense. But only when he's laughing in triumph, though. So we have to fight him and trick him into thinking that he's beaten us. Then we get him right in the throat. All right. Let's work on that. I'll give you the watchword. Practice. Practice. Practice and then practice more. And then more practice. Right. <laughs> Challenge. Hmm. I challenge you to a contest to the death on the 14th of this month on the main plateau, Walu Chen. enough. Well, I promise. You won't go back. We'll see. Cat! 
Mark! Ah! <laughs> 
save your little neck? I don't need anyone to save me. I shall kill you. Right. Think so? Well, now, we shall soon find out. Right. Think so? Well, now, we shall soon find out. Huh? What was that? What was that? You dare do that? You dare do that? Everybody, we must go. Now look, you take care of yourself, and we'll see you soon. Listen, as soon as I'm better, I promise you, we'll come up and see you. Mm. Make it soon. Off you go. Goodbye. I'll see you. <laughs> <laughs> 